We're moving in a direction in this country, in this world, where people of color, LGBT, different segments are becoming the majority. It was my mother who inspired me so much because um, she was the one who took control of everything when my father wasn't there. I'm a DACA recipient, so I'm not a resident. Growing up undocumented and still being undocumented and being in the workforce, um, it's always been that feeling and that need to work twice as hard. I was born in South Africa during apartheid, where real segregation and exclusion was mandated everyday life. So I really did grow up with gay moms in rural New Hampshire, which, as you can imagine, was not largely popular at the time. I was born in Singapore um, and raised in Singapore till I was about 15. Um, my mother is uh, South African and Irish, white South African, and my dad is Chinese Malaysian. Being at Fleischmann Hillard and being open about my story and talking about it to colleagues who are so supportive um, has finally given me the opportunity to be seen. When people have the courage to change their perspectives, great things can happen. I've used that powerful change to help me embrace new thinking. I like to think that, um, that I can talk to pretty much anyone. I think I have such a variety of backgrounds in my background that I can often relate to a really wide variety of people and empathize with a really wide variety of people. Um, I'm super curious about people's cultures and, and differences or similarities. Growing up with parents from two very different cultures teaches you how to see both sides of every argument. Um, and it teaches you how to uh, understand other people's perspectives. It reinforces my belief and my values in seeing women. Um, it shares the values that women should be respected, women should get equal opportunities, chances. As long as you're good, there's nothing stopping you. So this is what I love about this company. Visuals and representation can really change the course of history.